Hot Dog Knight, our solo snake main. Uh, currently number what? Five, I think. Five, yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, both of these guys are, you know. Bro, like the... that uh, banjo skin, for anyone that's wondering, is based off of uh, the character bottles from Banjo and Kazooie. But I, I feel like <laughs> I, want to, I feel like I should have said that. But. All right, back to the match. Okay, so Kazooie gun, the the. Uh, the multi one, yeah. yeah. I'm starting to see like banjos uh, get like more utility out of it. Like I see like Twitter clips and stuff, like on the platform, and then they'll, like get the reset and stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> uh, this is why I'm bad at commentating. I always get sidetracked it's super easily. No, you're fine. So it looks like both of these guys right now are just opting to kind of throw their projectiles at each other. You know, feeling uh, each other out. Yeah, banjo definitely has this a uh, very similar. Uh, projectile that snake does although it's a little bit more erratic in which way it bounces because it's that like football shape rather than the grenade shape both of these players both on their first stock still looking pretty even right now but it looks like HEK is starting to get a little bit of the download kind of understanding which way guys going to be moving what choices he's going to be going for let's go didgeridoo tv thanks for the follow all right so we've got guy in the air right now and just opts to go straight for ledge smart moves not something that you want to be doing landing on snake but he does do the unsafe wonder wing and um brian is able or hot dog knight is able to get that with the up tilt sealing out that first stock at 73 percent right now hot dog look, knight looking pretty good guy is getting a little bit damage tacked on from a lot of these grenades that snake has you know it's not something that you want to be dealing with when you are already uh, at a disadvantage He's trying to get something started, but he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to overextend a little too much because he doesn't want to get blown up for it. Yeah, exactly. He's trying to be a little more aggressive with his grenades, but Brian's still just sitting there, staying grounded, playing his game. Yeah. Keep him at ledge. He's waiting out for those Wonder Wings. He's not going to get hit by one. It looks like. Yeah, and guy can sometimes be a little bit predict uh, predictable and disadvantage. I think uh, as a veteran Smash player, Hot Dark Knight is definitely understanding of. Um, the habits a guy has. I mean, he's snake. He's gonna sit and shield all day, and he's gonna wait and shield those wonder wings. Yeah. He's not gonna get off. The exactly. Bed. And unfortunately, Nikita is gonna take that last stock, or that second to last stock on guy. So, right now we have uh, Hot Dog Knight sitting at only 100% on his first stock. This is barely anything to Snake. You know, Snake loves rage. Snake loves all this. <laughs> <laughs> Love to do solo commentary again, Taki. I would just love. Damn. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Lewis. Oh, and you just. Oh, the, God, he's so good at mashing. Brian's. I literally heard Brian's mash from in here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it looks like. He's a little something a little started. He's got a hundred. Yeah, he's a little something started, but he is really getting blown up both figuratively and literally. Bye. Later. Later. Bye. Yeah, bye. You guys suck. No, Go, Ike! Oh, I think I will. I think I will. Alright, um... <laughs> you know what, I said I wanted to do commentary today. I expected that someone would do it with me, but you know, it's whatever. It's yeah, fine. Everyone who Nebraska's... I know, Nebraska's solo commentator, the e-girl of Nebraska, Bumblebee. All right, it looks like Ryan is going to steal all that final sock with the C4. I didn't see if that was on the ground or stuck on him, but good stuff to HDK. Going into that game, too, I definitely think Guy is not going to be wanting to go back to PS2. It's uh, something that is just, you don't want to be on that stage versus Snake. There, I said it, but we're not ready for that conversation. I don't think we are. I don't think we are. I don't think Nebraska's ready for that conversation. Y'all just be taking Brian to PS2, and you're just like, yeah, this seems like a good idea. It's because we can't stop gentlemaning to that stage. Period. Oh, I can. I literally am like, okay, Battlefield. Okay, Smash Bros. I'll gentleman you to Battlefield. Please. All Everyone right, cool. Wants to play on PS2. I just, I don't mind playing on PS2, but I'm not going against uh, Brian. I'm like, no, Battlefield. I mean, no. sure, Smash it's good for Ike, but still. Yeah, I want to deal with it. Anyway, so we're going into the game two here, and Guy opted for one of his, uh, I see him on this stage all the time. I feel like this is probably like his favorite stage or something, but we're going into the final destination here. He is able to, wow, he just has two Wonder Wings just like that. The Guy Wonder Wing. The Guy Wonder Wing. 
It's like you have your normal banjo wondering, and then you have your guy wondering. Yeah, you think just... like, you think like, oh, he's not gonna do it again, because you only get to do it five times. But it's like, oh, he does it again. Like he does not care if that wonder wing is gone. But he is gonna get the down throw berry on that and takes that first stock against HDK with an up smash. However, Brian coming back uh, strong as ever, getting him off stage and getting a little Nikita stuff started. However, uh, we got a guy back on stage, just kind of doing guy the Kazooie his, bomb. Guy with his Nikita insurance. Yeah, true. He, he gets all five of them back now. Yeah. Well, he's got all these wonder wings back. Um, that was the first stock taken off of Guy for uh, HDK in this game. Guy looking for the F Smash 2 frame. I don't know how useful that's going to be at a low percent. You might just want to be looking for a down tilt bear at ledge. But, you know, yeah. whatever floats your boat. If you want the F Smash for the power up, I totally respect that. Oh, and he knocks him out of that Wonder Ring with a down tilt. Snake down tilt being, like, so stupid. But, yeah, that shit is literally like an anti-air, but it's a down tilt, so, you know, whatever. I don't want to talk about it. And Brian getting back on stage with the dare, doing plenty of damage. God, how long is this guy going to be on, on top of the stage right now? Brian is looking for some cheese, but not going to get anything off of that fair spike, unfortunate. Oh, why is... <laughs> Did you see that? I, I saw why that. That was, that was cute. Why did his legs do that when he was at a ledge? I have never seen that before. I did not know that's what it looked like. That's in Banjo Kazooie. Huh? Is it? Yeah. It looks so dumb. I hate it. Yeah. I hate this character so much. Why? He's, I he's hate cute. Banjo. I just think he's, he's ugly. Cute. I think he's ugly as hell. Yeah, there I said no. it. Oh. Anyways, a uh, guy taking the second stock off of HDK again with the down throw berry, but this time he only had the up tilt. Oh, and Brian is going to, HDK is going to take um, Guy's second stock with a C4. Just going to blow him straight up. At this point, I wouldn't see, I, at this point, I could see Guy just zoning grenade and egg over and over again until that. Yeah, for sure. He's definitely not uh, shy about using those Wonder Rings, especially when you're at a higher percent like this. Snake being a heavy character that he is, is not going to be killing him, like, super Ooh. soon. There goes another Wonder Ring. Ooh, and the spot dodge cancel up smash. Get to see the wonderful smash version of Snake's spot dodge cancel up tilt. But it's time on Banjo. So that second game going to Guy. Let's see what Brian's counter pick is. Definitely see him going back to PS2 on this uh, Guy Bandit. I mean, DSR is also a thing, so... Oh, we have DSR? Yeah, okay. And DSR. Oh, okay, okay. I did not see where they went. I didn't either. God damn it, Bobby. Yeah, oh. I, I know. Lazy streamer. Yeah, you're so lazy. Well, we're going back to the beloved Banjo-Kazooie vs. Snake matchup. Who doesn't love some good old Nebraska fun? We are, are going to town and city right now. I don't really understand this pick. I don't know. I really only see this people go to this stage when they're getting edge guarded super hard. But it could just be that a guy is just not wanting to worry about Nikita. Um, you never know. Maybe he just loves the stage. It could just be that it is a bigger stage, though. Oh, and he Wonder Rings the wrong way. What are you doing? Having to use two Wonder Rings just to get back on stage, unfortunate for Guy. Meaning he only has two Wonder Wings left for this stock. So he's just kind of zoning HDK out right now. He is a little bit higher in percent than HDK. Um, oh, getting blown up by double grenades right now. It's not looking super good for Guy's first stock. He's just not really going to want to... Tried to not interact, but he's still getting blown up while not, being inter while not interacting. But he does run in and get the down smash berry. However, HDK with the crazy mash again. Too good to just get buried. Just jumps right out. I didn't see how that first stop was taken. Uh, I was rubbing my temples. I have a headache. <laughs> oh well. Well, guy took the. Oh no, Brian took the. Or HDK took the first stock somehow. Now they're just mashing on each other on the uh, town city. Oh, okay. Oh, and he's looking for the nair. That move is so tilting to get hit by. I'm not gonna lie. Like, when you get hit by Nair, it's like, you just get hit by Nair. It doesn't feel good. Nothing really comes of it for the most part, but it's like, you're getting hit in the face with Snake's Boo like six times, but, you know, it's fine. And it looks like HDK is just gonna want to just kind of chill towards the edge of the stage. Um, 
Kind of just zoning him out with Nikitas, with grenades, all those uh, things in Snake's arsenal that he has. Ooh. And we have a guy in the sky right now. Ha. And we get a ha. And we get a snake up there and take that second to last stock. However, guy gets a pretty good wonder ring and it ends up taking that stock from HDK. However, we have both characters 0%. Guy on his last stock and Brian HDK on his second to last stock. Looking pretty good right now for HDK. I think right now he's just gonna wanna. Well, you would assume that he would just be chill and throw a grenade and Nikita not really interact, but Brian just loves to be aggro and goes in instead to do some crazy snake stuff. Ooh, what is he. What the? <laughs> you know, we're just not gonna talk about that. Uh. We have Brian just kind of opting to get back to center stage. Yeah. And Guy is just getting... Doing his the Guy Wonder Wink, you know. You know. Where's yeah. He, where is he going? Where the hell is he going? Oh, Brian's... Or er, HDK's mash is just too good for that down there, Barry. I think he's just going to have to... Do something else. Yeah, it looks like Guy is just used to how good... Uh, Brian's mashes and instead he's looking for the uptell. However, we do get HDK doing the 9 plus 10 is 19. Thank you. You guys are so haha -ha funny. Anyways, we got the tomahawk uptell coming out from HDK. 21? <laughs> no, it's 24. 21? 